Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and welcome to Bega, where we have a bunch of already waiting eager pilots. Let's see if we can get this uh, stream working properly. Now, I tried to press auto start, but I think YouTube uh, had a huge delay, so let me know if you guys can hear me let's pop on a camera get a morning everybody at least morning it is for me evening for Stu, hostad anybody else who's watching from uh nighttime area nice and early for uh sean atkins mate welcome the frog himself not a french man just he calls himself the flying frog or banjo frog um so good morning all says Sean, uh, Stu, mate, Steve Allen, hey everyone. Icarus, g'day, mate, Hostad, hi all. Alright, can you guys give me a sound check before we get in here? As you know, well, let's get back down on the ground there and get back into our plane. So I'm going to take the RV7 again. Um, I kind of liked it and I figured it might actually be a good plane to use. Um, fuel is on, thank you. Oh, no, roll the ball that way. Go right under both, thank you. Got it going, all right. Let's turn our beacon on. Nav, Stro, Peter, Heat. I don't know if we're going to need it, but uh, I am on live weather, and um, when I got in here last night, it was just a check. It was pouring rain. All right. 2 p.m. Uh, NorCal. I'm guessing that means local. Uh, <laughs> dead sexy. All right, we'll see if that's uh, going to work, actually. All good? Okay, cool. Sounds good. Uh, let's make sure that I can see. Oh man, try not to snore up. Try not to sneeze there. All right. Try and read some information on the. Oh yeah, and, and it's got my information. So I've got it down there, Weimar, which is. Um, previous airport that we took off from um, in the last stream because this particular airport at Bega or Frogs Hollow to be exact it doesn't actually come up so all right let's give this a run I don't think I got my park brake on do I yes yes I do all right I believe I need to take off from that end um, although you know what I'm just gonna go for it so Keep up, people. I'm on the move already. Now, I'm hoping the internet's going to hold out for me today. I know this is a bit unfair, but uh, I am already in the air. And I figured, why not? We'll just get going, because I've got a lot of road to uh, follow. This is one down here. Uh, that got everybody uh, caught there, didn't it? And we're like, oh yeah, sound check, yep, cool, yep, start up now. I've, I've, got, I've got two buttons and a uh, turn key. I've got my fuel already uh, set, so uh, we're good to go. Alright, let's see if we can actually hold level straight while we do a little bit of turn around and have a cup of, cup of joe. Hey, good morning, Fozzy, mate. He is in now. I am only on half throttle, so I'm doing 150 knots. I'm going to follow the Princess Highway as much as possible. Now, we're going all the way to Sydney Airport. So, we will probably stop in at Shell Harbour. Um, that's where I do need to actually uh, keep an eye on my fuel. So... For those who are still loading in, I'm not going very fast. Uh, so you should be able to c catch up pretty easy. But um, yeah, I think the stream, I, I don't, I really don't like the auto start function. Uh, I saw you in a big jet 
TV earlier. Jet TV earlier. Doing milk runs, say. Oh, Fuzzy's doing milk runs. 50 hertz, mate, welcome. Hey, hey, he says. Well, there's Stu. You know, PC21, I look at him go. Alright, I'm going to have to get my maps open too. So, I think this is actually Bega. Um, I'm not sure about Bega. I'll have to do a quick check, but I think that's where the cheese, Bega cheese, comes from. Looks like they're doing larger properties over there. Whoa, somebody just painted me green. Now, let's follow the Princess Highway in and out of here. I think that's it over there. Was it over there? Wait, hang on. Oh, now it's got me. What we'll do is we will get a map. Map, please. Now, I found out what the problem was the other day when I had a stream, and every time I looked to the left or right, um, my sound would disappear. When I select. Uh, unlimited data is available for Microsoft Flight Sim. Um, it uses every piece of data you can. So every time you look left or right, uh, it was searching and trying to download all the information. All right, so we will follow this road to a T-junction, and then we'll, we'll turn right. And that would be it right there, I guess. So it's probably less follow it. Uh, if it's less turn right, the more we follow it right. Oh, cool. So this is the A1, Princess Highway. Big lap with what we're doing. I see green circles everywhere. Now I'm not going to turn every time the road turns. Um, seems a little bit much but uh, we will follow it in its general path so we should be heading fairly north uh, in a moment let's get inside where's my compass yeah going towards north does it go up near the river oh yeah that's too Glendale all right through the mountains here we come Ooh, nice down there at the creek I wonder if you can get under that bridge. What do you reckon, Icarus? I think that bridge is not formed underneath, so I'm not so sure you can. <coughs> Excuse me. Kind of like a challenge, isn't it? Here he comes. Smoking up a green line. We'll see if that green line stops or he goes straight through. Hmm. Again, kind of looked like he went over the way the smoke is, but um, kept going. Banjo Frog, Budju Inc. Did you put a space in between your name now? Is that because I kept butchering it? Budju Inc. Sorry, Budju. Look how nice and green it is here. Alright, we're at Brogo. Oh, that's what I should have done. I should have signed into uh, FSX Maps. Uh, and then what I could do is actually track. Uh, I'll, I'll do that in the future. Once I get my Starlink set up. Um, so, for those who have been... Uh, mostly you guys are hanging out with me. Oh, I didn't like me clicking on my... Uh, my stream there. Oops. Um, my Starlink is in Australia now. It is in Melbourne Customs. Um, or at least it was. I didn't haven't checked today. But I did get an email from Starlink today saying that uh, they have, or oh, what do they call it? Opened up a request and credited me a month free uh, service because uh, so support request uh, 
they did it automatically. I think because my um, Starlink has been delayed on delivery, because um, they're going to charge me from like the, the 3rd of March, which is what, Thursday? Um, whether I've got it or not. And I'm like, are you kidding? And I was thinking, oh, I'm going to have to contact them and say, Look, this is not right. I haven't even got it. You guys are getting it delayed in uh, Los Angeles. Well, they've actually credited me a whole month, but because the bill will be coming out uh, and has already been processed, or not processed, but like forwarded, um, it'll be my second month free. So, look, even if I do get it by Monday um, afternoon when it was actually due, uh, I might be lucky to have a month off. So, um, I'll pay the bill. So, woohoo! All right, look at this. Look at this, is that not beautiful? Am I going too fast for you guys? What am I doing? Oh, I'm almost yellow line on it there. 180 knots. Let's tilt over so we can see out. I like this plane. I really like this plane. I almost need to make myself my own cockpit like that. Uh, the problem is what we got eight dials and then the other instruments there. I haven't got quite the same setup with my uh, Logitech stuff. But I am going to make myself a cockpit. Uh, let me know if you guys are interested in seeing the build of that or just the final product. Um, I, I might make a lot of it out of MDF. I've got MDF scrap around. Um, and I'm thinking about using some of that. Let's get my ISO line map on. All the hills are off to the left, so we're going to be going up the coast. No, not interested. Okay, well, I guess that's the no answer. That's the question I was after. Not interested in a cockpit. All right. Yeah, out of space. No, you weren't the only one getting uh, tongue-tied. Oh, sorry. Is my stream really that that slow? Oh no, have we got a delay. That's that auto start thing. I did not want it to do... You know what? It's going to change when we get the internet sorted. I'm, I'm kind of almost guaranteed. Want to see the build? Alright. Sue, yes. Want to see the build, please? Alright, cool. Is my stream pausing... Now, I'm, I'm borderline internet today. Um, it is pouring rain out there, it's buffering, yeah. If you want me to change over to um, mobile internet, uh, dang, look at Icarus go. Uh, let me know. He's painting a white line down there, that's awesome. I did say I may actually choose that plane. Um, maybe we'll do something further north of Sydney. Uh, that would be cool. Let me know if you want me to change. Um, do the build. Yeah, cool. I'm thinking about using the chair that I'm in. Uh, the gas shock occasionally gives way and just goes nut and, and drops. And then, like, it can sit on for hours, no problem. And then all of a sudden it goes, nope. Office chair says no. Let's get down there with him. Uh, let me know if the buffering becomes too unbearable. It looks like it's actually okay at the moment, but it's going up and down. Um, I'm, I will change over to mobile data. Again, like I said, though, it is pouring rain. Um, can't see from here. Let's get the booster seat. There we go. Actually, if we can't see the road, Let's try this. There we go. Now we can see the road. Tell you what, it's actually not that easy to turn. 
<laughs> All right, bit of fun. Sean says change. It is that bad, is it? All right. What I will do is I will probably pause it here. I wonder if we can do that. Uh, a lot of buffering, mate. I assume you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We don't have an airport around here, do we? Have a look. No, there's actually none here. So, whoops, you cannot fly while you press that button. Let's get up high. All right, we'll see how that goes. The stream's probably a little bit uh, delayed again. Do you know what, though? It's not going to happen for too much longer. Wow, I think they have a uh, bit of a road issue down there. My dad is probably trying to catch up as well. All right, so... Um, Go Starlink. Yeah, mate, it, this might be the last time I have to swap over to mobile data. So, uh, Iona says hi. Hello, Iona. Um, or, or is it Loana? Hang on, Loana. Is that a capital I or a capital L? Dracus. Hello, either way. I'm sorry if I've butchered your name. It's not on purpose. Uh, my quick glance at who's jumped in. I see the road is down there, but why is it not sh showing up? It's almost as if it's got a, a drawn map over the top. Meta says g'day, g'day Meta's. Were you guys flying, uh, doing your cattle run stuff, you and Fozzie? Did I see you earlier this morning when I jumped on? Um, also, let me know how that uh, internet is going now. I do not think that is holding. Oh, there's autopilot there. Okay. Cool. Love this plane. Love this area. So green. All right, how are we going with the internet? Uh, are we surviving? <laughs> We're surviving. It's a shame when you go to court like that. But, um, all right, Elon, mate, this might be my last pre uh, big lap prior to jumping onto your internet service, so it better be good. Expectations. All right. Let's have a look around. Who's around here? Scooters, not with us. I would say that that line is, yep, because making a uh, smoke trail down there. See, the road's not, wait, where does the road go? I think it goes that way, but the traffic seems to be going this way. What, where are they gone? Seriously? Road's in amongst the trees there. And then there's a, a, a magic bridge that just, maybe that's part of construction. Maybe the road has changed. The sim kind of knows where it should be, but uh, the algorithm isn't. Well, Icarus is certainly uh, painting a path for the road, isn't he? I guess we're going to go up over that bridge. Let's look at the back of my maps. 
Uh, yes, we do. We do go across that. That is uh, Corona. Okay, cool. Let's follow the smoke. Internet's good. All right, cool. I probably should have started on that. I did a test and it seemed right. Um, wow, look at this. This is beautiful. Except this fluffy little smoke trail that somebody's putting in front of me. Stu just hit a tree. How big are your trees? How low were you flying? This is how we can tell how low Icarus is flying. We can get underneath his smoke line. There you go. Let's try not to hit any trees. Now I do have the tree mod on. Uh, which is supposed to make trees whoa, a little more um, realistic height. <coughs> Excuse me. There's Mr. the Frog flying up above us. And who's smoking this all up? Can't see where the road is. I need to get Icarus behind me. All right, uh, 150 feet, that's a big tree. Okay, yeah, you don't wanna hit that. All right, North Naruma is where we're heading to next. Let's get a little bit of height here. All right. <coughs> oh man, excuse me. So Steve's in the SR-22. I did talk about actually flying that. Where does that road go? No, that's Coast Road. Oh, it comes back over to here. Yep, there, there we go. Uh, another bridge? Yeah, over there. This is a nice area. Let's just sit about this height. So the Princess Highway comes through town and out through there. So I wonder if we can click on this and get some information. <coughs> oh man, I need water. That's what I should have grabbed. Um, can I finish my coffee? No, I haven't. You beauty. Oh, it was even warm. Kind of, no, it was mostly cold. All right, Princess Highway. Out and around. Oh, it goes through. Oh, it goes through here. All right. Uh, like a nice um, holiday place there, Naruma. Then it's uh, Del Delmeni, Badala. I don't even know any of these places. But um, I'll tell you what. It's it's not a bad. Uh, not a bad part of the world, is it? Look at the beaches. Icarus is uh, down nice and low checking out those beaches. I bet they're clean too. You know, lack of population. Can do that for you too. Now, for those who want to come and fly with me, let's put the autopilot on so I can hold that. Thank you. Um, I'm flying live weather, live time, West USA. Uh, just some Aussie Gamer says, ooh, Numa, such a nice golf course there. Good day, Bryce. Um, yeah, that'd be, the, oh, I was going to say get back here, but no, it's probably actually right down there on the coastline. I missed it. Um, but how nice is this? Now, we'll keep an eye on where the Princess Highway is, because that is what we're trying to follow. Uh, we do go in, oh, Potato Point is up here. Huh. Just a little bit further north there. It's called Potato Point. Uh, Euro Bell Del A. What is Euro Bell Okay. Is that a name of a place? Alright, where else are we heading to? 
Oh, Bodella, yeah. Turos head. Whoop. Hang on. The Princess Highway go out that way, does it? Oh, yeah, we're going to go way out. All right. Well, I'm following the Princess Highway. You guys can uh, head up the coast if you like. I'm going to follow the road. How you going, Bryce, mate? Uh, you got a day off. you got a rest day. I know you've been working hard, training some new people. Uh, yeah, it's one on the coastline. Some of the holes require you to hit over the ocean, which is nuts. Oh, mate. Imagine how many golf balls are actually down there. You know, if you've got some kids that are good at uh, diving... Even snorkeling and going down and getting them. Uh, although, to be honest, once it's out in the salt water for any amount of time, can't imagine it's good for the golf ball. That's a lost cause, probably. But yeah, cool. Uh, did you see my previous comment? Oh, sorry. Uh, oh, it's pronounced Joanna. All right, cool. Where are you from, Joanna? So an L sound being a Y, is that like a Spanish or Portuguese way of um, pronouncing it? Uh, can I head forward? But, um, Joanna, very nice. Cool. Well, welcome. And we are flying up the Australian East Coast, so New South Wales. Uh, and we took off from Bega. Actually, it was Frog's Hollow, but um, that's the closest airport to Bega. And we are heading all the way to Sydney uh, today. If you haven't seen any of my other streams, I started in uh, Tasmania and I'm um, doing the big lap, which is following the uh, National Highway 1 all the way around the, um, the outside of Australia. But it includes this little strip in the middle of um, Tasmania to go up and uh, be counted because it's all part of National Highway 1 as well. Oh, that's my autopilot. Cool, thanks. I remember when my autopilot is on and isn't on. Uh, no, just an uh, 11 a.m. start on Sundays usually. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, so, nothing better than some breakfast and bread. Welcome to breakfast and bread. Cool. Uh, let you know there, Bryce, because I haven't seen or talked to you for pretty much the whole week. Uh, my Starlink is in Australia now. It got shipped and it uh, is sitting in customs waiting for delivery. Well, actually, I haven't checked this morning. Maybe it jumped on a plane or on the boat and is on its way. Oh yeah, you've got a uh, course hold, there we go, cool. Um, so, it's due here tomorrow by close of business. That's what they say anyway. So we'll see. I wonder if I can get an outside shot. Oh, there we go. Oh, we got a yellow smoker. He's sitting behind me. That's cool. That's pretty close, actually. I think he's going to smoke me. Oh, so close that he's... He's now making it look like I'm smoking yellow. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Joanna says, uh, it's not... Oh, it's an I, not an L. Oh, it is. That's okay. I did say, is it a capital I, capital L? Yeah, okay. Uh, and it's a Latin language. Cool. Joanna. Cool. Uh, so where are you from? Are you in Australia? And how did you go having to tell other people... Uh, about your name. Uh, have you have you had to actually like oh hang on like explain it to lots of people or am I just thick enough not to actually have got it? I missed the uh, turn off there somewhere. 
Yeah, there it is. Bridge. Because I was on autopilot. Hot rods following it in a hawk. Okay, cool. <coughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oof, hell yeah. I basically haven't uh, been on the internet much in the last two weeks. So I probably haven't missed a lot. Um, I know, I've, I've missed a lot. Like, a whole bunch of frames I've missed. <laughs> Uh, let me just line this up and reach over and grab a water. Alright. Let's put that back on, thank you. Cool. I just had to grab myself a water bottle. Um, Coffee, second coffee I've had today is making me a little bit uh, uh, stuck in the uh, throat there a bit. Or the weather, or all the talking, because I like the gas bag, as we call it. Now, have I slowed right down? Is that what's going on? Yeah, 120 knots. No, 130 knots? 130 knots. All right, let's move your coffee cup. Put my water bottle in place. Thank you. So, fuel I need to probably... Hang on. Turn. Turn. Thank you. Um, do I have a fuel gauge? Yes, I do. There it is. Two of them. Thank you. All right, we uh, only started with half a tank on each, so and that's 19 US gallons. I have no idea how much that is. Um, but we're below a quarter on the left. I kind of probably should have turned that a little sooner. It's all right. We'll be right. <laughs> yeah, this is still there. Uh, where are we now? So... I think we're in, we're crossing the river, M My Maruya, and Maruya Heads, uh, I don't know if that's the right way of spelling that, and Bimbimbi is next, well, there's a name for you, Bimbimbi, how beautiful is it here though? Well, that road's not uh, not very well. Uh, Mark, that might be my internet. I don't know. But that is the right way. Let's see what's the next. All right, there is an airport here that we could land at. Well, I'm not going to. Um, but it is over there on the coast, so if anybody wants to, or if you're flying the um, the route, that's the way to go. I don't think my satellite picture is coming in very well. You can see it's very slow. Um, when I go to mobile phone, I get great upload speed, but I get terrible download speed. Uh, I am from the USA, uh, but I am a citizen of Italy as well. My whoop, the plane stopped. Don't crash, thank you. Um, my anglicized name is uh, Joanna, uh, but I use the Latin variant which uh, uses the I or J letters uh, with a Y sound. Okay, cool, yes. I have some uh, Costa Rican friends, um, and his name is George with a J, O R G E but his name is Jorge um, and, and uh, you know d different language from different people I've seen is like okay J and or G gets different pronunciations and I, that's why I asked about Spanish because it's the only people I've um, ooh, whoa, 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 what'd you slow down for uh, it's the only people I've 
I've seen where names are completely different. Whoa, something's happening here. Oh, we got a bit of a hiccup there. I don't know what that was. Um, yeah, yeah, so cool. Well, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <clears throat> Steve, Big Zoo at Mo Mojo. Mojo. Who's Mojo? Uh, oh, yeah, Mojo. Uh, which is probably actually not too far from here. But I am following this highway. We're doing the big lap. And I don't know where the, the zoo is. Can I turn that? Oh, you are on autopilot. All right. Fighting the autopilot. All right. Straight. No, no, straight. There we go. Cool. Um, <clears throat> that's not straight. So I can hold the altitude and the direction, but sometimes it just wants to play f funny. All right, there, there, and there. All right, cool. Pronounce mo go, mo go. All right, or move it. Uh, New South Wales Sapphire Coast, one of the nicest and most underrated places in Australia. That's where I'm now. Cool. Uh, wait, where's this road going? That way. I don't think my graphics are loading in quick enough now because I changed to my mobile data. So I'm probably even not giving this enough um, justice. Climb a little so we can follow this road and see more of the beauty here. Uh, oh, we're near Batemans Bay. That's what this is up here. All right, and Bait Haven. And Lily Pilly. Hey, cool. You can definitely see that big clearing. That's for power lines. All right, can you hold that? Cool. I think my autopilot is doing it. Either that or I'm free sticking it. Whoa, we just got a large building. I thought they got rid of most of those large buildings. Alright, I might take this back up to about 140. Give or take. Well, I might give. That one's actually 150. Alright. Yeah, my um, Princess Highway is, is... You can see the traffic, but the actual highway is not coming in. And there's Banjo Frog, sitting at the bottom of the tower. Ah, well, I didn't know that Batemans Bay had a tower. Oops. Batemans Bay still looks good, even though my graphics are not keeping up. Let's see how it goes. Kings Highway is coming up on your left. That takes you to Queen Bean and Canberra. Oh, yeah. Well, we're not following the Kings Highway because that would be the B-52. That's a, a musical group that uh, use that name. Oh, they already do. Uh, I'm heading up to Banadara. Then where else are we heading? Right up to... Burrow Lake, Aladala, Molly Mook, there's some names for you. And then we head back in town, go around Jarvis Bay, up through Falls Creek. Yeah, alright. Nowra. Cool. Alright, that's where we're going. You okay, Sean? No, I think Sean was checking out the uh, base of that tower thing there. <coughs> I think we might have tried to see if he could uh, get through it. Oh, hot Rod's in an F-16. Hello, Hot Rod. Oh, 
know why it's got some sound for you, doesn't it? There's an F-16. Something we don't see in Australia, but we don't have F-16s. Alright, now that my highway is back again. Poor Luke's like, ah, oh, what? He's peeled off. I just got into formation. Follow the highway again. Um, Wayana says, uh, I am on infinite flight during my first leg of my first world tour. Hey, cool. Uh, from LAX to Honolulu, by the looks of it. Uh, only because I recognize the codes. Cool. I have done that flight in real life. Myself. Honolulu to... Um, Sorry, from LAX to Honolulu. I've actually done it a couple of times. Um, I spent a couple of years in Hawaii. So I have flown from... Um, oh, where have I flown? From Seoul, Korea. Uh, to From Honolulu to Seoul and um, from Seoul back to Honolulu. Uh, I have flown LA... Honolulu a couple of times and I've flown Honolulu Auckland uh, New Zealand uh, and also flown Honolulu and Jakarta so I've done a few flights in and out of there but hey cool on infinite flight what's infinite flight remind me I've heard of it I'm not sure I'm uh, overly familiar with it. Okay, now my graphics seem to be working better. Probably, probably uh, was loading in the town. And that's probably why. Uh, Dre just touched down in Vegas on holiday. I see his YouTube post. Yes, I saw that he had a YouTube um, from Las Vegas, but I haven't actually watched it yet. I was preparing loading in to my sim <coughs> earlier today. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, man, that last coffee gave me phlegm, I think. Or made my phlegm get... worse. Probably the milk in it. Alright, where's everybody else? I think you can almost follow this uh, power lines cut out. Oh, there. There you go. And I have no mouse. Are you kidding? Oh, I successfully connected. I lost the mouse. It's a fun video. Alright. I will check it out after. Did the internet really go down that low? Wow. Uh, see the Vegas uh, night lights from the air and, and taxi. All right, cool. So, but he's, he's flown there in real life, not in sim, right? Uh, he's staying at the Excalibur. Cool. Oh, it's Houston. I thought it was Honolulu. Ah, oh, Houston. Uh, yes, I've been there once. No, twice. On my way to Costa Rica. It's very really nice there too. Wow, that's a long little flight. Oh, no, it's probably about the same as going to Honolulu. Um, sorry, oh yeah, I, I saw H-O-U and I thought, oh, is that Honolulu? No. Houston. Cool. So what's the infinite flight though? Uh, just some Aussie game says either that or the last coffee gave you COVID. Last coffee gave me COVID. No, I'm not. No, it's um, I'm not lactose intolerant, but I do find sometimes when I have milk that uh, or milk products that it gets a bit of a phlegm in the back of my throat that I've got to cough out. So I, it might be my sinuses start running when I have it. I, I don't know. 
It's not COVID. <gasps> like the slightest cough anybody has. COVID! COVID! My wife has to do tests every two days now for work. Um, those are rap, rapid antigen tests, rat tests. Um, luckily they supply them for her as well. Yes, live and radio, okay, cool. Um, because there's such an outbreak at her um, school that she works at. Crystal Eagle is in a H135. Very cool. We're going to probably see a few more names. Look at the beaches down here. Is that not nice or what? I wonder if I'm a little too high. I seem to be getting plenty of uh, cloud. Look, it might be a high chance of raining at Sydney, but um, I'm going to stick with the live weather at the moment. Uh, infinite flight is a mobile flight sim. Ah, cool. It is. I, I was I was thinking that, and I'm like, eh, maybe I'm wrong. All right, let's get this organised to fly so I can look around. Uh, where did Sean go? Oh, look at the rainbow edge there. That's nice. Looks like Steve's off to get the uh, pot of gold there. <coughs> Sounds like you might be susceptible to A1 protein. If that means that when I have um, to cough or get phlegm when I have uh, milk products sometimes, yeah, all right. Glad I turned the camera off for that one. Woohoo! All right, Princess Highway, are you below me? I think you are. Hang on. Oh, it goes through town, does it? Right up around here. It's out of there. All right. So where are we? Milton? Mollymook. Is that where we were? Yep. Uh, and now we're heading towards uh, Bendalong. <laughs> There's a name for it, Bendalong. Fossey says, I'll be landing, landing 16 right uh, in Sydney soon. Okay, well, we'll be a while. Uh, Sean said he had to restart hitting uh, Batemans Bay Fake Tower. Forgot to map reset. To control it. Oops. Uh, Wayana says, I am AFK in chat. Alright. You're cool. Well, I'm going to have to get down here lower. I can't see where they're. Alright, keep an eye on the altitude. Oh, speed's up. Get down below the cloud there. There we go. I think I might have needed to go inland a bit. Yes, bend along. We need to be following it around the water. So our Princess Highway is back over there with stew and stuff like that. So I can hear an F-16 here somewhere. Poor Luke, every time I get uh, into formation with him, he's like, I, I like turn and, and fly a dwarf miner. Hello, dwarf miner. Now, I'm trying my best to follow uh, Princess Highway. Is that it there? 
Yeah, it's very likely to be it. Or oh, that's a river. The river. Yes, it is. Yatty Yatta. I'm not even sure where that place is. Anybody see the highway? I lost it. Ha! Ah, wait, here it is. I see trucks. Hey, I found it. Wow, it is uh, misty here. Alright, but I did find the highway. Very good. got rain running off my, uh, or moisture running off my windscreen. Um, that is cool. Hey, there we go. Nice and clear. All right, we're back out in the clear. Now Steve's over by the coast. All right, so um, if you're following me on a map, I would be at... Conjola. I'm not even sure how to pronounce that either. I'm just inside from Jarvis Bay. So Jarvis Bay is over there. Oh, he's an F-16 buzzing me. Let's see how well he can buzz me down here. You're running off the road. Oh, try not to hit any trees. That one got a little bit over speed. Oh my god, we're at 300 knots. No, 200 knots. This thing's not meant to go 200 knots. Follow that Princess Highway. Now, can you guys actually hear my music? I might have turned it down fairly low. I don't know if I asked about that. How much fuel you got in that there, Luke? Oh, did the weather just update? Or did I uh, literally just fly out of all the mist? No, you can't hear the music. Oh, you didn't like me pressing that slider, did it? My GPU says no. And we're back again. No, yeah, no. Oh, the weather kicked off and then come back on. Okay, we just downloaded. Still downloading. Three megabit per second. Whoa. I'm thinking I might turn off the live weather. If I'm going to follow a road, my internet is going flat out trying to download the weather to keep up to date. And we can't see much. I think we're going to end up in nothing but a storm. Oh, look at that. St. George's Basin was a water runway during the war. Is that Jarvis Bay? Come on. What, what, what are you... Why are you affecting my graphics while you're downloading? Seriously? Alright, where's my mouse? Give me my mouse control. Thank you. Let's turn off this live weather. I am tanking with graphics. My graphics the GPU kept running down to 30 something percent. It's becoming a slideshow. It's 
downloading the data and we're getting close to Sydney so we're a little louder for music all right let me just turn this off cool now I want some cloud there we go so a little less uh, low level but uh, man does that do a lot for the um, There we go. Yeah, now I'm now my uh, sim can run properly. Uh, and we can work out where we are. I'm guessing that's a motor record. Just past Jarvis Bay. Falls Creek, I guess we're heading to next. We're going to need to follow that road down that way, I believe. Okay, so I'm still downloading stuff, but I'm, because I'm not getting the live weather anymore, uh, I think it's actually running smoother. Woohoo. Highway. I believe so. Yeah, it looks like we're going a little bit more to the left up here. So let me just put on the screen. Oop, let's get that there. Um, so this is Jarvis Bay here. Um, we are heading past, uh, I think it's Wollongong into Sydney. So there is an airport here if we need to land at. YSNW, which uh, I cannot remember what that was. Let's have a look. It's uh, now a military base. I was using it as a waypoint. So uh, if anybody wants to land there, uh, that's it. All good. Okay, cool. Well, what I'm going to do is put on. Let's go back to there. Since you guys haven't heard most of this music, I've been playing it. It's not been showing up. So heading towards Nowra. And, uh... Is it Bombardary? I think it's Bombardary. Looks like Stu's heading towards the military base now. Quick land, if you can. I might do a touch and go. I reckon they'd uh, be upset at me uh, coming over to military base to do a quick touch and go. How are we doing with fuel? How about I, uh, I top up fuel? And you know what? I'm going to go top up fuel. Take this back off. I'll zoom in though. So I can. Uh, oh, I didn't like me pressing that. I zoomed in and then uh, froze. Touch and go. You can do a touch and go. Uh, ego. Some retro. Ergo. Some retro. Uh, is in music that you're talking about? Hang on, did I miss something? Let me get on the uh, runway here somewhere. Looks like there's a bunch of runways. Actually, I should have come in this way. Um, Nara was a RAF base until the 50s, now the Navy owner. Uh, now I'll give you clearance. 
Oh, I'm gonna do a tight. Whoa! What did I hit? Turbulence. Oh man, what happened there? That'd be enough to uh, be a stomach churner. This is coming in the wrong angle. Height, isn't it? Can't see for all the uh, red smoke, almost. Now, what have we got with uh, fuel, I wonder? Is there a fuel station over the back there? Back that way. <coughs> Good, mate. Let's run up, uh, what is this one, 03. I'm sure they don't mind me just steering wherever I want to. Nobody else is on the runway. Uh, Stu says, uh, see you, bye all. Thanks for letting me fly with you. Uh, good one for working, uh, work in the morning. Yes, mate, Stu, I understand you need to get going. My timeline doesn't necessarily work too well with you because you do need to at least get some sleep before work. Um, but take care, mate. And um, when I get the internet uh, fixed up a little, I think what we'll do is I'll get in a couple of... Uh, streams at a different time um, like evening streams for me i'm contemplating a tuesday and thursday night i used to do thursdays but the internet was just it was just too painful i tried i tried multiple times and it's just yeah what why is there a tower in the middle of the road or not the middle but on the side that's a bit rough that's a bit of a uh incorrect placement yeah we got another f-16 there how do you like my high-speed taxiing? Anybody see a fuel a Bowser? There it is. Oh, oh I just got that turned on time, didn't I? Ha! <laughs> it's even a fuel truck. Hey, mate, you got anything? Something's wrong with that uh, A5. No, it's not the A5. It's that uh, other fancy plane I got. Yeah, it's on its wheels. Bring it in and get some fuel, please. There we go. Look at that. It automatically pops up. Love it. Let's take it back to, let's say 60%. I don't think I need that much. Uh, so what's that? 90 litres of fuel. Uh, everybody's saying see you, Stu. All right, cool. Is that a helicopter or a... I hope so. Alright, I'm going to get a move on. Oh man, this thing is like a race car on the road. Awesome. Okay, fuel is at... Uh, it says half there. I thought I'd put it just over half. <clears throat> oh, I looked away and it's frozen. No, no, we're good. <coughs> you can see that. <laughs> Let's see the G of, of turning my plane tilt a lot. All right, so we're now a military base. Let's get a move on back in to the air. Wow, that's a taxing through those things? Really? Oh, Steve, mate, did you just fall out of the sky? Oh, look at the wind. That, that definitely got us up real quick. Oh, sorry, just checking my trim. Make sure it wasn't... Uh, 
point in the wrong direction. Uh, gonna do vertical. There's Steve Rings. I mean, Steve Allen, did you just fall out of sky? But yeah. Metas, I see Metas now. Uh, I reckon he's doing a Melbourne to Sydney run. Uh, I can't see Fozzie though. He might have already landed. No, we've got to get back out to that uh, Princess Highway. Just back this off. Looks like the highway here. It wasn't that far off. Okay, that's my autopilot, thank you. Now right, we'll go through now. I am downloading flat out, I can tell. But uh, without the live weather, I'm actually liking this better without the live weather. Fozzie says, I see you guys. I could see Metas, I couldn't see you. So, I'll have a look. So I got Metas. Steve Rings is here. Buju Inc. is here, which is uh, Steve, Allen, Hot Rod, Luke. Uh, lost Sean altogether, mate. Sean, did you. As Icarus, did you continue on down the coast? I know you were resetting, but you, you came back in, didn't you? Maybe my, ooh, hang on, I need to follow this Princess Highway again. Where are we? Through there. Straight ahead. Now oh, we're going right. Um, yep, Melbourne, Sydney. Okay, cool. No, he says, I see you guys. Not, not see you guys. He sees us. Because they're flying from uh, uh, Melbourne to Sydney. So Metas might actually be, I'm still climbing, aren't I? Yeah, thank you. You're supposed to hold a level there. See if we can actually lower that. All right, Princess Highway through now. We want to turn right at the Y junction, and that would be it there, because uh, the other one heads out the wrong way. Okay, cool. Uh, no, behind you. Okay. Yeah, see, mobile phone data doesn't seem to stick with everybody. Maybe it's uh, something to do with that wall over on the South Australian border. I don't want to uh, allow the service to go through. Ah, <laughs> I kid. Um, I don't know. I, I, you know. I do blame the mobile phone data. Um, but yeah. So Metas, we could see him. That probably means he's in that 200 nautical mile bubble. Which means Fozzy is probably not that far off of him. Uh, which means they're probably going to beat us to Sydney Airport. Because we're still following this uh, Princess Highway. All right, Y-B-E-Y is over there for those who wanted to uh, land. I'm not going to. Like I said, we um, the last one, we pretty much... Oh, can, you, can you hold a level there? All right, press it once. There we go. Maybe I'll uh, bring it down even more. So... It's not live weather, but it's almost the same as live weather. Here we go, get below that uh, cloud level. You're with Steve Rings now? Alright, cool. Are you guys still flying out of... Okay, Steve's in the H145. Alright. Now I need to go and buy that, I reckon. I'm probably going to... 
I, I mean, I, I follow their Discord. I've seen their new announcements. They've even got a giveaway going on at the moment. But I never actually got in and got early access to it. H145, that is. Same guys who made the H135. But they've got some new stuff to it as well. Metas, he's a little in front. I crashed the desktop on takeoff. All right. Look at that F16, is really. There. Having a little trouble staying and going this slow. Look at that. So there's this line of where it thinks the road should be, so it puts them in. And then there's a satellite picture that it is where the road is, and it won't put, it won't uh, join them up. Maybe we'll get a little higher. I'm not supposed to follow it that low, I guess. All right, let's have a look on the map. Welcome to the nine people following. We are currently on our way out towards uh, Kayama, which is on the coastline. We're following the Princess Highway as much as we can, but it keeps disappearing. Now, see, it thinks it goes over there. I don't know whether they've actually already done that in the satellite pictures, just old. But if you're going to update Australia, update the satellite pictures as well. Otherwise you have a road in the grass field with traffic running on it. Well, there's some epic music coming along, isn't it? downloading a lot of satellite picture stuff but it's just not loading in at all. Uh, so much for world update. Yeah. Look, it might be that my internet's just not keeping up. Uh, mobile data seems to download at pathetic speeds, but it'll upload at great speeds. Ooh, we've got a pizza bringer. Did you bring pizza? Did you bring the pizza? Pizza please. Bam, those icons with the pizza icon. I need to turn. Maybe I'm trying to put some pizzas in. There we go. Pizza! Pizza, 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 pizza. <laughs> oh, that cleared. Steve Allen's got a pizza slices. Way to go, Steve. All right. Somebody else has gone live on Twitch. Somebody else I watch usually. Also says, thanks, Fozzy. It was going to crash. What did Fozzy say? Don't know. Because it's coming in with the blue. Look at the clouds there. So I, I turned off live weather, but I put on very similar um, weather. All right, Princess Highway goes right down near the beach. How about that, eh? Yeah, I think I'm having trouble with the internet. Oh, well. Won't be long. Uh, everything started beeping, and I didn't want to stall. on top chat no 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 why, why is it on top chat and not live chat i want to see all of the chat thank you there we go now 
now. Shell Harbour, yes. This is where my internet's uh, struggling to keep up, so I'll climb a bit more because I think we're uh, putting a lot of data in. changed by dev mode and hasn't changed his um, ID name. Alright, we've got to go around. We don't have to go around. But I do have that airport there, Shell Harbour, as a, um, a waypoint. Oh, that tank for a second. Didn't like me popping the autopilot back on. Hello. There we go. Fly that direction. Cool. And we've lost our whole LG. There we go. We're climbing. And look at that. We're actually doing 160 knots. Very cool. Keep an eye on our fuel. We're good. All right, uh, for banning the spammers. All oh, right, uh, I thought I actually jumped onto it. I reached over and pressed ban, and it stopped the third message. Usually there's three messages like that. Um, I need to ban that word, love face, and I also need to ban, like, when you put in X, Y, Z, um, and vol, and I don't remember what the other one is. But I've got some other ideas of how to get rid of some of the, uh, the spam and... Shell Harbour. Hey, you reckon that got its name, hey? YSHL home to H A R S H A R S home to what do you mean? Uh, the layer is so bad it gets. Uh, Gets it before me. Oh, he gets. It. Um, I have, I have Stream Labs um, chatbot where I can just go over and press a button, and and it uh, basically the button says ban, and as soon as I see the chat come in, I just reach over and press that. So unlike on um, moderating on other people's channels, which I've done, are you kidding? Come on, you know what? Let's get some of the beauty here. Actually, maybe it was better the, the satellite picture. I've got uh, Minecraft graphics now. It might have been uh, better to stay. Woohoo! Things are not loading anymore. Love Shell Harbour! fly from <coughs> here. I've seen some new videos from there. Uh, we're going to get out over the water into Sydney. No, what we need to do is we need to follow it. Oh man, we're, we're uh, shuffering, shuffering. Alright, we'll sit here for a moment. 
Um, now. Michelle Harbour City. We go back up Wollongong uh, Waterfall, East Coast. Actually, it's not too bad. We actually do go through the Royal National Park, East Coast National Park. Yeah, I've driven that road. Stanwell Tops. Yes, stay there too. There's a decent uh, campsite um, facility there that I've actually done some things. HRS is Australian and Aviation Museum and they fly their collection. Catalina, Connie and more. Oh, why have I never been there? Alright, I've got Minecraft graphics going on at the moment. Lake Illawarra. Okay, now the graphics have caught up. Uh, so, Lake Illawarra was that one back there, I'm guessing. Cool. Is this Wollongong? Wait, no, Shell Harbour. Wollongong's here. This is Wollongong. Alright. I'm over Wollongong right now. I do remember there's a decent road that comes down the hill too into Wollongong. This one here. Many lanes. I actually went down and looked at buying a car here in Wollongong when I used to live in New South Wales. Long drive, but uh, it was a good um, price on the car. don't think we ended up buying it though. Um, even though it was a good price, we got there and I think the front of it was stone chipped the living daylights out of it. It's been going up and down the, uh, the main road here, I'd say, um, to and from Sydney for ages. And they did put that on the on the photos, all the description. So you get there, and there's this car with absolute hundreds of stone chips across the front. Uh, and we're like, "Come on, guys, serious? You know, you didn't mention this, and you you're offering this price. Oh, we're, we're not negotiable. Okay, see ya. So we went. Right. So Princess Highway is this one here I believe oh is it the railway line as well no I think it's oh you know what it might have <laughs> might have been that one that goes up there now so it may actually be the one that's up the top of the hill here where are we yes it is wait M1 oh this is where it gets a little bit which one is it? I think it's the M1. No longer the A1, but it's all part of the same thing. It becomes the A1 again. Alright, so yeah, it's actually up on the uh, cliff line here. So this, this road here that we're coming back over. But look at that line. There we go. There's some detail. What I wanted to see. Come on, internet. Come on, mobile phone, you only got a few more days to go. So Fozzie, have you landed, mate? Are you already down there? There is a Neptune there as well. Whoa. Yeah, the delay, the delay is bad. Roll on Starlink. Yeah, how, how far back is my uh, internet? Oh, well, probably about 20, 30 seconds. Um, I'm hoping that I can actually press uh, extra low latency latency but we'll see we have a green goblin in the distance looks like a golf course or two down here one's looking pretty brown there. Uh, Fozzie says touchdown. I hate autocorrect. <laughs> SA not far now. Oh, S, uh, Y-S-S-Y or Sydney not far now. No. 
no, some of this I now actually know where I am because I have driven this road. Where some of the other stuff down, um, I don't think I've ever been to Bega. Because uh, with his green smoke, yes, there he is. Look at him, he's, he's drawing a coastline. I can't see it down here. Can't see it back there anymore. But that's cool. Alright, where are we? And we'll touch. We'll get ourselves to waterfall. Probably flying over or near Lucas Heights. Lucas Heights is the only nuclear facility in Australia, I think. I don't know if that was it back there or not. Here somewhere. Um, where they make, uh, I don't know, nuclear or radioactive products for medicine. Uh, because we don't have a nuclear power plant, nor do we have nuclear missiles uh, or bombs. We don't need them, mostly. I say mostly. Get down Heathcote, Ingerdean, Kirawi, we'll go through Cogra, Inham to a Mascot. You know what? By the time we get to there, we'll actually line up the airport. So we'll follow it in as much as we can. Yes, we are landing over in Sydney here somewhere, not too far away. <coughs> um, I might take runway seven. Uh, only because I often land there, but uh, being a small plane. But what I might do is I might do a quick run around Sydney and then back down. What do you reckon? How far into this stream are we? An hour and a half. Well, we got time for that. Come on, we can do it. We can do it. Look at all the trees. Nice, nice. I I kind of like my tree mod, and I can't wait to show off my view of what I can see here at 4K to you guys. I'm looking forward to that, and I'm looking forward to having the internet to actually uh, run it all. So. Starlink, you got a lot of uh, expectations to live up to. I think that's where I normally turn there uh, and go out through this way to get back up to um, north area of Sydney. I um, can't remember the name of that road now. The uh, Heathcote Road, yeah, okay. So it, it basically takes you back out towards Liverpool, and then what you can do is you can go around uh, without having to go through the CBD of Sydney. So we're in the southern suburbs of Sydney. I think we're right in over uh, well, Heathcote, it should be. Ingerdean, Heathcote, yeah. There's a little bit of a tour. Tour. So what I'll do is I'll follow this right down into the city as best I can. Uh, you can just see the city loading in on my horizon now. And you can hear the internet cutting my sound out, trying to load. Oh man. You 
Sydney's looking pretty good. Now, uh, for those who... Oh, wait. Uh, I've lost the road. There it is. And then we turn that one. And follow it. Um, for those who are flying with me, if you don't have a Sydney add-on uh, stuff, you may notice some, like the Orbix one. Um, where is Point Piper? Uh, don't know. I don't remember where it is. I know of it, but I don't know where it is. Sorry. All right, Sylvania is where we are now. We're going to cross over. Um, I do need to turn right in there towards uh, Cogra to stay. And what we'll do is we'll fly right over uh, the airport because the A1 drives underneath the runways of um, Sydney Airport. So we'll turn here and we'd actually, um, you can see a, a wide junction down here. We turn, oh look at that, I'm getting a bit of frame drop there. I'm getting a lot of frame drop. Um, we turn right at that uh, intersection and we head up through Cogra and we will actually go right underneath, the, well we're not flying under it, but we will go right underneath the um, runways, the north-south runways. Oh, we're going to get a few uh, stars here I reckon. And what I'll do is I'll, I'll make a run around Sydney and then we'll come back in and we'll land at runway 7. Uh, Point, uh, Piper is in the city. Point Piper is in the city. Yeah, okay. Uh, upper houses on the um, beach, New South Wales. Okay. Point Piper. I don't know which one Point Piper is. Uh, uh, we're following this main road. No, we're supposed to be doing the one on the coast there, is it? Where is it? No, it's right below me. Oh, okay. Now there it is there. Oh, it goes down there and then over. Okay. Whoa! Alright, so it has a um, dog leg that goes down to this road here. This is the A1 there. And there's parking space or gate 77 where... Holy schmoly, are you kidding? Why are you so slow? And the A1 goes underneath. Wow. Um, I'm going to pause that for a second. So the road goes underneath here, but for some reason I am downloading or installing or something. There we go. Thank you. Alright, so this is the A1. Nice, got 317s loaded in on the gates. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, for some reason I was getting, whoa, I was getting uh, totally uh, bamboozled by the internet there. Alright, so we'll follow the A1 right smack into this city. which then also again becomes the M1 and runs across the Harbour Bridge. Uh, so what I'll do is I'll loop back at the Harbour Bridge. Let's get a little bit of height. We're having trouble with the internet. I'm getting a slideshow almost. Yeah, suffering. All right, there we go. Welcome to Sydney everybody, I've done a lot of flying here in the sim, obviously if you've watched any of my videos, we will make our way back around, I'll come back in and probably land at runway 7, I don't have live weather on anymore. <coughs> You're following Kingsmith Smith Drive, yes, which is also the M1, which is also the National Highway one, so it's a multi... Um, 
a multi-named road. So yeah, basically it's this one down here, next to the golf course there. Uh, it runs in here, goes through the city. Uh, no. Oh no, it goes underneath now, that's right. <clears throat> Comes out uh, over here somewhere. Is that it there? Yeah. Out there. And then up and around onto the bridge. Alright, there's my double uh, center point tower. Still waiting for Orbix to fix their uh, Sydney add on. like uh, Queen Mary's in town. Alright, we'll go back and we're going to uh, land. Is there a yacht upside down? down? Oh no, it's a ferry. So this, uh, this road down here, or this, this circle, this is actually a road. So you come underneath, uh, no, yeah, you go off there and go around and under. So it's, it's actually a loop road, even though it's got a building in the middle of it. Wow, I'm having a little bit more issues here. All right, so Banjo Frogs, hey, he's showing up now. Anzac Bridge is also doubled up. Uh, still waiting for Orbix to fix that Sydney update. But without it, Sydney looks boring. Uh, even though they've fixed a lot of the buildings, they're nowhere near as good as the um, Orbit City, so I've got both installed. I don't think I'm on autopilot, man. Right? I think it's just free. Free flying! Now, to be honest, we probably would not land this aircraft at this airport. Uh, you're more likely to fly out to uh, Bankstown Airport out here somewhere. Cool. Check that out. You change it and you do not like me changing that. All right, we suffered through the internet, but besides that, we actually still got some really nice areas to look at. Um, welcome the 11, no, 10 now, 10 viewers. There we go. I knew there's gonna be a C-17 anytime soon. side than we do on the other. Oops. Now Banjo Frog is down next to Scored Coda. Probably need to uh, get a little bit more of an approach here. Can't see over the wing. Looking back. Oh, we're looking back at Icarus. Okay. Might look at doing some uh, VR flights too. Probably not on this journey though. This is my uh, every week Sunday morning for me. Oh, look at the shaking going on. Is there a little bit of turbulence? I think so. Oh, there's a car coming out across the highway, oh, across the airport, runway. Good on you, mate. Well, you can do that. I mean, I didn't announce that I was landing, so. All right, what was that? 2.34 feet per minute, popped up. It might have been a little bit harder than I wanted. <clears throat> you know what? I'm gonna be cheeky. 
and I'm going to pop myself over in my parking spot. Hot rods in the F-16. So uh, parking bay 77. Uh, what can I say? I'm a sucker for a C-17 coming into land. All right, cool. Uh, so we are at Sydney Airport. I will take off next week, uh, Sunday 9 p.m. 9 a.m. Sorry, uh, GMT plus. Uh, 11 because daylight saving hasn't changed yet let's get up there there we go all right cool uh well do you know we're not that far behind on the stream um i'm watching it already taxing and landed so that's cool why do i have the old icon on my um oh because i haven't updated that okay Alright, still comes up as F-16, but I think he's in a C-17, to be honest. Oh, look, we've got baggage, uh, a baggage cart here waiting for us, because we got lots of baggage. Not. Perfect time with the music to stop, but I wanted to move forward. All right, cool. Park me there. Let's see if we can watch Hostad uh, coming in. Cool. Oh, you can only just. Oh, seriously? Graphics? Come on. It'll miss out a lot of that. All right. Other way. Thank you. Uh, let's put the fuel to off. Thank you. Batteries are off. Alternators off. All right. Oh, I'm getting freezing. What's going on? There we go. Thank you. Uh, welcome to Sydney Airport. We've got Icarus and Banjo Frog over in the international side. Uh, Hot Rod has stopped. We probably actually should have gone down to um, past Hot Rod there because that's the uh, freight and other private area. But um, I chose Gate 77. All right. Thank you very much. That was a lot of fun. Uh, I am going to stop there. Um, next week we'll be going Sydney to, I don't know, probably, depending on what aircraft we use. I, I like this one. I might look at another one. Uh, like I was mentioning last time, the uh, SR-22 is nice, but we could potentially try something different. I don't want to go too much faster than this, um, but the internet might actually be a lot better by then. Look at the hot rod backing up. Uh, laugh out loud, crash the desktop, but I've I've been landed. All oh, right. No banjo frogs having to move as well. Um, but we will continue up the coast. We might check out things like uh, the big banana, see if that actually exists. Um, we'll find out. Thank you very much, everybody, for uh, joining me and putting up with my hopefully the last of my um, dodgy internet. So we'll see how it goes. So, yep, see you all. Cheers. Thank you.